Maths Week 4. In this video, we're going to focus on BODMAS. But you'll find the information inside the downloadable lesson notes for Week 4. It includes long division, BODMAS and negative numbers. If I turn through the pages, I get to BODMAS here. Sometimes this is called BIDMAS with an I where the O is. BODMAS is useful for doing calculations in the correct order. So sums that have more than one maths operation, like addition, subtraction, multiplication or division, we need to know which order to carry out those calculations. BODMAS or BIDMAS helps us to do that. It tells us which order to do each of those calculations. The word BODMAS stands for B for brackets, O for order of indices, so indices are those powers. We might recognise those from our squared numbers, our cubed numbers, where we have the small two or the small three. The D is for division, the M is for multiplication, A is for addition, and S is for subtraction. And that's the order we carry out the calculation. So anything inside brackets goes first, then the indices, then the division, then multiplication, then addition, then subtraction. We're going to work through this first example, which has a number of different order uh, uh, maths operations. So the question says, work out five times three, and inside brackets, 18 divided by six minus 12. So the first thing I'm going to do is write out my sum and go through it step by step using BODMAS to help me. At the top of the page, I've written the word BODMAS here to remind me of the order of operations. So first of all, I've got B for brackets. So with my sum, I'm going to focus first on anything with brackets. So I'm going to focus in this area here where 18 divided by 6 is inside the brackets and the 3 outside the brackets means that everything here is multiplied by 3. So 18 divided by 6 is 3 and because it's multiplied by 3, I'm going to put 3 times 3. 3 times 3 is 9. So I'm just going to put my 9 underneath so that I can continue with the rest of the sum. Continuing along bod mass, do I have any indices to do next? I don't. Any division? Now the division was inside the bracket, so it's already done. Continuing on, I'm going to look for any multiplication. I do have multiplication. Five times this, which I've already got is nine. So I'm going to put five times nine and 5 times 9 is 45. I'm going to put my answer underneath and then continue along the rest of the sum. I don't have any addition. I do have subtraction. That's all I've got left. So with my answer 45, I'm going to minus 12. 45 minus 12 is 33. So my final answer is 33.